So are you getting the full thing? Just about, yeah. Well, instead of zooming out, why don't you pull back a little? Get it okay. in context, right? Okay. Yeah, just keep going back. Yeah, that's good. It's cool. Yeah, it's amazing. Yes, it is. Mr. Bregman? Yeah. Colonel Tom Rondell, Cheyenne Mountain Complex Public Affairs Liaison. <laughs> that's quite a mouthful. Call me Emmett. Yes, sir. Okay. Uh, this is my uh, posse here. Tech Sergeant Dale James, Mr. Cameron. And... Airman, First Class Chef Wickenhouse, Chef's sir. Chef's doing Sam. Well, it's a pleasure to meet you, sir, but what are you doing here? We're getting some establishing shots, first of many, I hope, while we're waiting. In fact, we should get a shot of shot of you, uh, Colonel. I'm sorry, but uh, you're not authorized to begin until you've been briefed by General Hammond. I've already been briefed. Tom, is it? By the Defense Department. What's the problem? I'm cleared to shoot here. Maybe maybe you guys haven't been cleared. You've been cleared? We're clear. Sorry, what, what is, what's the problem here? General Hammond's ready to see you now. OK. This should be fun. Oh, yeah. General Hammond, sir. This is Mr. Bregman. I'm very excited to be here, sir. You may find that we're not all quite as giddy as you are about this project, Mr. Bregman. Giddy? Uh, <laughs> I, uh, well, I'm personally and professionally uh, excited. I think I said excited uh, to be here, General. I haven't been giddy since, uh, well, you don't want to know about that. No, no. I just want to be as clear as I can up front. Sure. Your presence is highly unorthodox, and I will not let it threaten the security of any ongoing missions or the safety of my people. Well, I've already been frisked three times. We can make it a fourth time. You can do it personally. We get to know each other a little better, General, if you want. I'm sorry. I consider it my responsibility to protect my people's interests. And I quite understand. frankly, I feel it's appropriate to warn you that no one around here wants to be part of your little reality show. Oh. I see. You know, General, I think you're probably well aware that there were film cameras on the beaches of Normandy decades before Survivor debuted on CBS. And personally, I think it's an outrageous oversight that the Stargate program hasn't been chronicled up to this point. That's because it's top secret. Only a handful of people will see anything you shoot. So far, General, so far, eventually, inevitably, this program is going to be disclosed to the American people and to the whole world. And I like to think that this little film that we're doing here might in some small way provide insight into what's really been going on here for the last six years. What's really been going on? <laughs> you know what, General? I respect what you're doing here. I can even respect that you want me out of here. But the President of the United States invited me to do this. You see that, Red Bull? You wouldn't be here if he hadn't. Well, then I hope I can expect the full cooperation of you and your personnel. To the letter of these orders. To the letter, I see. I see. Thank you. You have high expectations to meet. General? <laughs> 